already got one Rolled up in my left hand Look at you scream or a genie You're a witch You're a witch That whole package Plus you pay your taxes uh. And you keep it real While the mother stay flat So buy another round They try to shut us down About an hour ago But we still in this bitch Boom. So boom. So boom. So boom. This is Bobcast. Yeah. This is a special episode. It is. It's a special oh. episode. Yo, it's always a special episode when my favorite people are with me. Oh. Y'all are my favorite. Oh. Y'all make me go, no. 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 <laughs> um, Funny. I just want to know. If someone could tell me, and we don't have to figure it out right now, because this is the Bobcast, mm-hmm. and we can do what we want to do. Period. This is it. You know, this is us. This is But I just want to know, I'm just curious. What's your worst drunk story ever? Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. With the crown on top that says ever. This oh is, God. takes the cake. You should this remember it. Cake. Well, if you remember it, that's the gift of having a drunk story. If you don't remember it, then hey, you you ain't got you can't claim the fame. So there's a difference between drug like and this. drunk stories. So we're talking right. about drunk or drug stories. So do you drug feel like or drug stories? Two different things. I feel like okay, most fucked up. Oh. Like this is the most fucked up. <laughs> fucked up. <laughs> I know what mine is specifically because how long it lasted. It lasted too long. I had to go from like airport to airport. Like oh. it was long. It was brutal. Okay, so let me hear y'all's because then I'm going to know if y'all telling the truth or not because I already Okay, know. I'll go first. I already know a lot of stories. That's true. I mean, I, I don't want to say how that works. Story, how the fuck well, Tiff, you Well, Tiff, you, Tiff, Tiff gets slizzy yeah. on a whole nother level. I know a whole couple stories about <laughs> When Tiff gets slizzy, it be like super slizzy. Slizz me up. You know what I think is, it's just that like Tiff can hang through the slizz. She can. I can't. She's a real G. She's a real G. Yeah. She can stick through the whole. Next thing you know, it be like slizz. But see me, I'm going to pass out. I'm going to. Know what's I'm gonna, going I'm on. gonna collapse under the sleeves. Well, you don't always know what's going on. You don't know, and Next she be thugging know. it out. She be thugging it out. Yep, thug world. That's Tiff. Tiff. <laughs> when we Teach us how to thug Tiff, it out. Like you should have just told me from the jump. Like, listen, I'm a thug ass <laughs> nigga. And that's what you I. You need am. to be ready for this thug life if you're trying um, to be with me. Period. Are you like warning labels or something? I mean, you're scared. <laughs> Maybe. Okay. You gotta I might, teach I might the be kind of scared. Life. You gotta teach niggas how to live a thug life. I mean, yes. I didn't know I was gonna be thinking. Thug life. You gonna be thinking? I didn't know I was gonna be thinking. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know I was gonna be thinking the thug life. Thug life cannot be taught. When I when I was choosing yeah, when I was choosing on Baltimore race born and when I was choosing on her I ain't know I was gonna like have to you sign up on her? for the Tupac lifestyle. Yep. Like, I gotta oh. get my stomach tatted. Yep. I had to get a so nose a ring. Cat. I mean, That's Tupac was bald, like but Tupac bald, but I could I could do the bend. Oh, this a hat. Eastside. Ooh, I, got a hat I got a hat on, not a bandana. Wow. So, all right, I'm gonna tell y'all my my slizzy story. Slizzy story. <laughs> Starting now. Starting now. Okay, I was already on tour. Okay. Back when Tiff was dancing. Okay. We had me. Me. <laughs> and me, and me, and me. Wow. <laughs> Dyla and Dyla and Dyla. Listen, it was me on stage, mm-hmm. a drummer, a bass player, guitar player, a DJ, mm-hmm. three background singers, okay. two dancers, okay, and also extra staff <laughs> to do the sound in the front of the house and the lights. Okay. Lighting guy, front of the house guy, monitor guy. We had a fucking football team. Okay. I was traveling with the New England Patriots from 2009 to 2015, 14. Wow. For a good like six years. Let them know. Okay. (laughs) So we were already on tour. 
just to paint this picture to you, this is not like something we planned for. We already had a tour, and you know who we was on a tour with? B.O.B. and his entire entourage was on tour with Paramore, who hoops, hoops, the lead singer of Paramore, Haley Williams. Shout out to Haley. Shout out to Haley Williams. Haley Williams. Haley Williams. Haley Williams. You should come on this podcast and this tour. It'll be so fucking lit. I never met you, but I heard so many stories. Yo, it's gonna be lit. So Haley Williams is on airplanes, and yo, Haley Williams. I'm sorry. Hold Did a little, you say little. her name right, bro? I'm sorry, bro. Say it again. <laughs> Haley again. Williams is a real motherfucker because even with her being in Paramore, when we was on tour, she came out on my set and did airplanes before she was even supposed to grace the stage. And she did it right. Could I say that I would do the same? I don't know. If I was featured on somebody's song and they were opening up for me, would I come out on stage? and do the song on that set? I don't know. But she's fucking real. And y'all don't know, Haley Williams can fucking dance. Haley can dance? Haley she can fucking dance. Dancer. She was a dancer. Oh, y'all never told me that. No, she Haley like. Haley can dance, dance? Yo, yeah, she was a dancer. She first. was a like dead Amazing. ass, like dead ass. Wow, she can dance. That's awesome. So nice. she would come out and it's like, you know, this is my first time having this level of fame. This isn't like, you For know, sure. Usher coming back with the 26th number one. Like, I'm <laughs> I'm like, this is my first number one. So what's it like? What does that feel like? Is it like, <laughs> like, what do you feel? Are you like, I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. Well, Everything's lit. Well, you what, is it, what is it like? <laughs> Everything is lit. Is it, it like, is. what does it feel like? Is it but like, see, I feel like I, I popped off in a time where I was one of the first, because there was a lot of shows where I was the only nigga there. Right. There was like me and then Neo, and that was it. It was like everybody else was like Katy Perry, yeah. Taylor Swift, uh, like it was all so it's like it's us. Austin Mahone, like, <laughs> like it was just me. Like it was just B.O.B. <laughs> It's just B.O.B. And then everybody else had bands in full production. And I was like, wait a minute. Why can't I have my full band here? Why am I here with just a microphone? Why do they have the full production? Who's paying for this? Is the label? Because I know the artist ain't paying for it because that shit is expensive. Right. You want to you wanna go from state to state and have a full band and full background singers and big ass snowman and big ass lights and Christmas lights? And you want to have pyrotechnics? So even with that, I was told that I I heard through the grapevine that y'all, even with that, were there girls falling over y'all then? Or did the girls on tour come later that were with y'all? Because I... What do you think, Tiff? I felt like I understand the question. She's so talking saying, about she's talking about like the girls, the girls that were with her. The Have girls dropping been? the girls that dropped the panties and threw the bras. Right. Did that come at the beginning or in? Yeah. When the did end? that fall into place? Um. I mean. Come on. We have different answers. No, we don't, cause we because we're both we were both there. That are like, we were both there. Y'all been doing that, and then there's people like, no, nah, then they just started doing that. It's like, I mean, it's just kind of like, it it's just kind of like cool. some, it's just kind of like something you kind of discover because mm. people was like, yo, why are you, why you got a girl, and you got the number one song in the world, or what the country, this? or whatever it was. Right. Look, I just know at one point, look. This is all I knew. Yeah, what happened? Because I was the what artist happened? where I was like, I don't give a fuck. I don't care. I don't care. Like, I did a red carpet with, like, it was like Haley Williams and Katy Perry, and it was a huge right. thing, a red right. carpet. And I just wore fucking sweatpants and some <laughs> fluffy house shoes. Yeah, fluffy. Fuck them up with and that. a fucking <laughs> raccoon that's head. I didn't to give a, a fuck. I was that. like, <laughs> fuck y'all. I don't give a fuck. Oh, I know exactly what red carpet the, that yes, was. Yes, it was a red carpet. And, and so, then, did the bitches swerve after that? Because I know bitches like all I that. didn't even know enough they to like, even they realize like the it. effortless. Mm. But I just knew that like motherfuckers were like, yo, why you got a girlfriend? Like you, you got the biggest song in the country, in the world. Why, like, why you, you got why a girlfriend? You got a, why you got a girlfriend? Why you got Niggas a girlfriend? Niggas was asking, 
Or bitches was, was asking. Niggas was asking. Bitches was asking and niggas was asking. No, no, no. Asking. Niggas was asking. Why would you have Bitches might have been asking too, but not to my face. But niggas will ask you to your face. I'm like, why you got girl? Because I'll be like, bruh. We cannot. And so we cannot it's be like, like, hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Me and my girl <laughs> both have girlfriends now. Like, come on. Like, what are you doing And then here? what do they yeah. say? And then they say, I can't relate. Because I got a girlfriend. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> but you know, it's like they be like, I don't got nothing to do with that. You start, to, you start to experience things that you would not think that you would experience. Like, like, you know, <laughs> motherfuckers coming up to you and being like, "I'll fuck you and your and your bitch." Ain't never happened to me, but. Uh, Sounds actually, like, hold on. Man, Wait a minute. Hold on. That never happened. Wait a minute. He said, "Walk up Stop. to you and be like." Uh, that happened before. That happened before. <laughs> where? Uh, when we were in fucking uh, where we, Liverpool. Liverpool. <laughs> we were in. <laughs> That's why she laughing because she know we was in Liverpool. Oh. And a chick came up and was like, uh. Uh, the girl that you're with, I want her. She didn't speak to you first. She did exactly, uh, exactly. And then That's she flirted. And then what? she flirted. She came no, straight she to like her. No, and she acting no, like ain't nobody came to her. And she acting like ain't nobody. I'm being very specific. Okay, what she do? What'd she she do? was talking about she and I, and then I had to let her know that I had. There was no like you and your and guy. And what she say? Only you. No, she was like, okay, well, I'm down. But I'm saying, if there was no B.O.B. Yeah. there, she would have came up to you and been like, I want to clap the cheeks. Which is against the, the example that you that's, what I, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> okay, and that's all I was saying. So that's the, those are the things that started to happen. Bitches are saying. I wouldn't say started to. That was one isolated experience from very early on. Oh, like, so that was early before yeah. y'all was even into the shit. Yeah, I mean, she loves tattoos. Into it she she started, really, she really loved it. tattoos. Tattoos. <laughs> and we had a few tattoos. I feel that. Did we? I probably only had one. Back you then. have only had like two. You might yeah, have two. No, just, and I this, probably just uh, had This is reminding her shirt is reminding me of the meme. The meme that's well, I, I don't know. I, to be honest, I'm gonna be honest. I don't know how everybody's doing the whole switchy things on their heads. What's the switchy things? Oh, yeah, yeah, You know what I'm talking about? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it, it's, like, it's like a thing that says, I think it's like kind of like, what do you plan on being or something like that. It asks a little question yeah, and then it like flips through a, through, bunch it, of characters, through a whole I bunch guess. of characters. It lands on <laughs> and one. Then to, and then it's like Sleeping Beauty. Like. <laughs> so, so the <laughs> apple, Snow the apple switches, Snow White. or what? Yeah, it lands on Snow White for Tiff. Yep. I feel like Snow White was a Capricorn, to be honest, because that hoe was real mouth. Yeah, well, Snow White was real mouth. Mm-hmm. But everybody well, basically, wanted to follow her. She we in, like try. like basically you know I got all this success and it's like you know I feel like in this industry you have to be groomed to be an artist. Okay. As much as it looks like you just somebody that's like I don't know nothing I just became successful I just became boss. This. <laughs> like yeah like that shit is bullshit. This that is shit, my question. This is my that question. That shit doesn't happen. Go ahead. This is my question. So Go. you got lots of people that want to be rappers. They want to mm-hmm. be artists. They want to be this. They want to be that. Mm-hmm. When do you know it's time to throw in <laughs> the tight towel? When do you know? When do you know it's time to stop? Well, I don't know. Do you know it's, it's, people like it's, just like. When do you know it's just it's just not working? But see, look, it's you just could not you could be, be you. if you, you can find it, it ain't working. You I could mean, be. You could, you, J- you could be a Jay Z 40, or you could be a, another 40. What? So it's like, wow. you could be Jay Z at 40, or you could be somebody else at 40, and it's two different 40s. Two different, two different 40s. 40s. <laughs> so, when do you okay. know? When do you know? I don't know. You know, can I be honest with you? Be honest. Of course I can. People want to know. I don't know. I don't know what type of 40 I'm going to have. People got kids. I don't know. And they abandoned in their family. (laughs) 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 They're doing all these things. Mm -hmm. And I want to know, when do do you kind of gauge 
bitch, like, okay. I don't know. And I, I got to say to any of my music fans, and I'm not talking about fans who are fans of just, you know, the things that I do outside of music, which mm. is whatever. But if you're a music fan, don't gas me. Stop fucking time out. <laughs> don't fucking gas me. Don't be like, yeah, man, put out another album. I'm just saying this because I'm in your comment section right. and someone can see my comment. Like, right. stop fucking doing it. Don't fucking gas We're me. We're not doing that 2020. Don't fucking gas me. Like, stop it. Because I'm already done. I'm already tired. I'm already like, yo, this is my last album. I already nice. did it once. It's not though. <laughs> <laughs> but stop fucking that's gassing. Real. But anyway, so that's, that's all I'm issue. saying. That's all I'm saying. Like, stop gassing people. If she mm. can't sing, stop telling her, yo, you can sing. You, you might, you might got, like, stop that. Cut that shit out. Please. Let's get to know people. Because then you make it harder for people like us to be real with people and they think we hate it now. Right. Because we being honest. Right. And we be like, yo, I don't know who you been consulting with. And now, and now you're a hater. And now I'm a hater because and I'm being honest. Says, okay. okay, now y'all hate, now y'all hating, y'all hating, y'all yeah. hating, you know. And hey. that's why I don't like nice people. Mm-hmm. That can we, why do we get so like, fucking nice quiet? people? Like you can nice hear people. I don't like, like nice people. I don't like yes, nice hey. people. I can see that as an artist. Cause as I don't like artist, nice people. As an artist, I will understand that from your standpoint. Because no. it's constant, constantly like, you constantly got to hear, oh, yeah, your, this shit is fucking lit. You know what? This, yes. Bye. And they be like, bro, you, you, got, you really you, outdid you yourself got, on this one. <laughs> I don't like, want that. Yeah, you need honesty. Yo, that's, that's why, honest. yo, that's why I love, I love working with Cal. I love working with you. Yeah, cause like, because because Cal is gonna fucking tell you. Gonna Cal's gonna be like, like, "Uh, that wasn't it." Okay, <laughs> <laughs> yo, Cal's gonna be like, "Yo, do you want to see this?" <laughs> I was gonna say, I think, I think we should. I do think it we again. should do that again. Uh, <laughs> we should do it again. So, so it's like you need that. You need yes. yo, and motherfuckers can't take that. They can't take it. So stop gassing people so, up. So the 2020, issue, all the 2020. issue is not that people can't. It's that the issue is that people don't have enough honest people around them to really build themselves. You don't have enough honest people around you. you and guys, in order to have honest people around you, how do you, even you do have that? to know what. Oh, the AC cut off for this what? one. <laughs> you have to know what honesty is. Oh. Oh. And motherfuckers don't know what honesty is. Ooh. Ooh. You don't know what honesty is until you need it. And then you're like, God damn, I shouldn't have been so hard on my friends. <laughs> <laughs> when they were trying to tell me, look, so bro, that's is, not the style. What is honesty? What is honesty? I mean, I feel like honesty. Let's start there. I feel like, I feel like we should start there. What's this honesty? all began from like my your most drunkest story. Yours? Yeah. Well, just I just heard. asking the question. Just asking the question and then giving an honest answer about what's your drunkest story. Even oh. if you can't remember it. Well, that's the honest truth. What's your <laughs> drunkest story? Even if My you drunkest can't story it. was we was on tour with Paramore. <laughs> the lead singer Paramore had a song with me, and they also had their own hit songs. And it was also on tour with Fun. Which Fun had the song, uh, Fun had the song with uh, Janelle, Janelle Monet. Yeah, yeah. Yes. we tonight. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. Yeah. We are young. Yo, so I'm on fucking tour. B.O.B., who also has nothing on you in airplanes, is on tour with Fun. But this was before Fun had that song. And then we're on tour with Paramore. And <laughs> on top of all this, I have to leave this tour and go to the European Music Awards with fucking Jesse J, Kid Rock, uh, I think Sia was on the awards, Robin Thicke, fucking. Like, I'm a nigga from Decatur who was strung out on Black and Miles. Y'all understand what this What's is like for me? Zone 6 or Zone 7? Zone 6. six. I'm a nigga six. from Zone 6. Nigga from Zone 6. <laughs> in the middle of fucking the United Kingdom. Mm-hmm. 
-hmm. where they refer to the leader as your majesty. I'm like, who the fuck is your majesty? I know about Magic City. I hate you, Majesty. Like, I know nothing about this. I'm out there with Jesse J. Hell no. I remember one time I performed with Jesse J. She started twerking on me. I was like, whoa, like, I didn't even know. Yo, Jesse J is lit. Yo, if you don't know, Jesse J is fucking lit and she be, and she gonna throw some cheeks on you. And you better be prepared. And she gonna hit you with the runs. And she gonna hit you with the runs. And she gonna be looking at you like, yes, I did it. And she's gonna be like, and I don't drink or smoke. It. And I'm like, well, yeah, damn, okay. <laughs> I don't do so, so I'm out there at the EMAs and it's fucking crazy. And um, they introduced me to um, Kid Rock. And so I parted with Kid Rock. And Kid Rock is testing my game. So he's like, yo, I don't, I don't really think you're from the hood. I don't, you know, you like, you out here, you are, you know, you nice. You talking about you play the guitar? Nice. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Nice. So, I'm hanging out with Kid Rock. You know, like some of the uh, Jackass crew is there. Like, uh, like Bam, Bam is there. The Midget, Bam is Wee there. Man. Yes, Bam is yeah, fucking there. So Wee Man right. is there. I I swear to God, Jared Leto Wee was there. Man. And I don't, I'm not 100% sure Jared Leto was there, but I, feel, I swear to God he was there. We all in the room mm. and Kid Rock is like testing my Gangster guitar ability. And I'm like, hold on, Kid Rock. Wait a minute. He, <laughs> don't be trying me right now. You. Give me a guitar. I swear to God, yo, if I'm not lying, yo, I swear to God, Kid Rock goes, yo, someone bring a guitar. I swear, <laughs> like, somebody goes, I don't know if it's Jared Leto <laughs> finds a guitar. Or, or somebody from 30 Rock, from the sun, 30 Rock, whatever the <laughs> fuck. <laughs> I was drunk. I was wasting. Someone comes oh in gosh. with a white guitar, and they hand it to me, and I'm like, "All right, let me show this motherfucker." What I can. And do. if you a Bob fan, I started playing "Letters from Vietnam" on the guitar, and fucking Kid Rock is like, what did he say? "Give me that guitar." Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Kid Rock's like, "Give me that guitar." And this nigga lays this guitar down on his lap and grabs a bottle of Jim Bean, not Hennessy, Jim Bean, and he starts fling, bling, 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 with a bottle of Jim Bean, I swear to God. I'm not fucking. <laughs> in his fucking, other hand. In his like, other hand, and he's, when, 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 he's playing slide guitar uh, with a bottle of Jim Bean. And he's like, oh, I'm not letting B.O.B. show me up on guitar. Let me fucking flex yeah, with a bottle of Jim Bean. He goes, when, 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 I swear yeah, to God. Wow. And so, that's the last thing I remember. The next morning, the hotel staff, they're trying to find me because I have to go. I'm on tour, right, mm -hmm. with Paramore and Fun. I'm on tour, so my label executive is trying to find me because right. I, have, I have to fly, excuse me, I have to fly back to Dublin, Ireland to do the second show of the tour. So many things. Mm, so many things when you have the number one lot. song. Yeah, what, what are you supposed to do? What are you supposed to do? And Hayley Williams is on it with you? And you have Bruno Mars on it with you? Like, come on, like, come on, y'all. Like, come on, bro. That shit, you that shit is meant to happen. You can't plan for that shit. You can't plan those things. So to come my first of all, I swear to God it's like a music video. Cause I'm laying in my bed like oh uh, like half dead. And then the hotel, the hotel staff, and first of all, the EMAs in 2009 or 10, whatever, that was in Italy. Mm -hmm. Madrid. Madrid. Right? Mm -hmm. And they don't speak English, all of them. So I was laying in my bed, the hotel yeah. staff comes in, he sees a guitar in my room, he picks it up, starts playing it. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. Then he, puts, then he puts what? it down and then he walks out. No. He doesn't even know what? I'm still in the room. He doesn't know I'm in the bed like almost inches from death. <laughs> like I'm laying and I'm fucked up. Then my hotel staff, my nigga David Miller comes in. The, real, the realest nigga from the UK I've ever known, David Miller, that comes like in. Such a strong name. He fucking helps me up. Oh, he David. Puts, he helps me get into my pants one leg at a time. Oh. I'm just like, oh. <laughs> I'm fucking, yo, wasted is not even a word. I'm fucking dead, basically. <laughs> I'm a dead corpse. <laughs> and he's resurrecting me back to life. Shout Carries out to David me, Miller. Shout out to David right. Miller. Carries me out the hotel. 
throws me in the car. We get to the airport. He throws me in the luggage cart, pushes me in through the security luggage in the luggage cart. Five. In the luggage cart. You exaggerated. I now. swear to God, <laughs> he puts me in a luggage cart. And we, I'm just. You ain't in no luggage. Tiffany. I'm in a luggage cart. He ain't in no luggage. I could, cause, and I came to Tiffany in Dublin, Ireland, before the show. I can't believe it. So I'm getting wheeled through. Uh, <laughs> really, really wheeled through. I'm fucking wasted. That's all bad. They take me through security, and you can't take the luggage carts through security. So they right. put me in a wheelchair. So now I'm in a wheelchair, like <laughs> just fucking wasted. Get through security, get on the plane, on the plane, ugh, I'm gonna barf, ugh, throw up on the plane, get off the plane. They put me back in a luggage cart. Because right. it's not done. You still got shit to do. When you party, when you Nigga, party, you asked for this. You still got shit to do. You when, asked you, for this. when you party with Kid Rock and the cast from First Jackass all, Kid Rock and possibly God. Jared Leto. Like and, and, Kid Rock sounds like it's possible Jared and, Leto. and you know what's crazy? On a later date, I did a, a halftime show in Detroit. And Kid Rock was there Kid he, Rock sounds because like a lie. because Kid Rock has like a box suite. He sounds like he lit as fuck at the Detroit Man. Nuggets or whatever the fuck. Like, and I'm just like Kid Rock, you're just Kid fucking Rock here. Kid Rock sound like you don't want to fuck with me. So you, you know it's like you know it's like Rock and Roll Hall of Fame type shit, and you just like fucking with it, like you just gonna just drink all the liquor. And I thought I was. I really oh, did. I was like, I can hang with y'all. Fucking from Eastside Decatur, nigga. Hell yeah. We got black and miles, nigga. <laughs> we, we can black hang. And, miles. <laughs> and so, by the time they wheeled me out the airport when I got to Dublin, Ireland, first of all, Dublin, Ireland is the headquarters for drinker. For drinkers. For drinkers. <laughs> for drinkers. Drinker. Yo, Dublin, for drinkers. Ireland is the headquarters for alcoholics. Dublin, okay. Ireland turns up the hardest. They drink the most. They can hold the liquor the most. It's the most fucking lit show that entire tour. <laughs> and when they dropped me off at the hotel and I finally got back to Tiffany, I was like, Ugh. That was actually the venue because we were already Can't sound checking. It. But they had Nando's there. At the venue, yeah. Mm -hmm. And I was like, I want some Nando's. You know about Nando's? I was about to say top because I don't know what they are. Nando's, so what, what Nando's, is. Nando's is, okay, Tiff, you have to chime in on this because it's you really. It's the UK's Apoyo Loco. Really? I mean, like, it might be like the like Chick fil A. Better, it's like, like Chick fil A, chicken. KFC. Chicken. But, okay, okay, but look, 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 but look. Yo, all my fans Fried in the UK, chicken. I understand. I don't know. I understand Nando's it, doesn't make fried chicken. Is it it's not fried though. It's, it's like, not fried. It's fire grilled, I thought. It's we're fire. talking about context here. In America, so Chick Chick Fil A, Chick Fil A's is where you I go for that chicken. Was fried. That's fried. Yeah. Where you go for grilled chicken? Well, that's El why I, that's El why El I compared Loco, it. But that's El Pollo Loco, but that's not okay. Really all right, if it's okay. Not a super, if it's some though. super delicious, El Pollo Loco, <laughs> if it's super which is like lit. a really. Yeah, I just people, had to compare it to something. Maybe go like to El Pollo Loco yeah. if you live in L. That's why. That's but like why, everybody that's goes why, to Nando's out there. Though. That's why I love everybody, Tiff so because she knows. Everybody, so that's giving me like a. That's almost giving me like a Popeyes vibe. Uh, yeah, but Popeyes, Popeyes, Popeyes is fried, 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 fried though. They don't have Nando's fried. isn't fried. It's all grilled. Is yeah. the shit lit? It's lit. It's fucking lit. Like how lit? Like when you go there, you're gonna go there. Like, when you go to, to you, when you go you to the United mean, Kingdom. You're gonna go to Nando's. Are you gonna eight piece nugget thing that uh, you like to get? Uh, no, I'm like? gonna give you two chicken breasts yeah. on some rice and fries and sauce, dipping sauce. And so it's literally El Pollo Loco. El Pollo Loco. What is fire? If you're not, it's if you're fire. not in LA, you don't know, what, you don't know yeah. what that is. So Gosh. we need to know is that like, is it like a Popeyes? Is it like a KFC? Is it like a chicken? And that's what I was saying. So it's not none of it's that. It's more it's like a chicken spot. Level, it's, it's more not, like. It's not. Okay, but it's so, that so, so. crazy. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Chick fil A to me, in my opinion, is not a chicken spot. Mm. It's Why not. That? And you know what I'm saying. <laughs> it's a it's a batter spot. It's a spot you go for batter. You go for the service. <laughs> you go because it's nice service. Chicken's good. The chicken's good. It is. But you can get the fries, the nuggets, 
You can go in the morning and get the chicken biscuits, the egg biscuits. Mm. You can go get the Six. frosted lemonade. Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A bestow down on us your blessings. And I'm just saying, it's like, Sunday. Open, Sunday. Up, open, up, open up on a Sunday. <laughs> but I'm just saying, okay, so. Open up Sundays at least once a month. Okay, so like, you know how, okay, I put it perfect example. You know how Chick-fil-A and Popeyes had a, who got the chicken sandwich? Right. That's not what Nando's is. Okay. Nando's is grilled seasoned chicken. And you get rice with it or fries. And it it's, says lit is like a lit lit place. But it's it. what a Chick Fil A or a but it's KFC. A are, are the locals in? Because I know Nando's. Locals like, we used to go as as people touring. That was like the tourist okay. Spot. They, they like, do what this. about the locals though? Nando's had a system where if you come in, they give you they give celebrities a black card, okay. and the more you order, they give you points on your black card so that you can then order more Nando's chicken. Okay. More free Nando's chicken. But how I want to know Nobody how rewards. good was it? Good enough to where if I left. It's decent. The United it's decent Kingdom there. drunk and hung over as fuck and come back to Dublin Island. I'm like, yo, fuck give me some Nando's. Nando's. That's what the fuck and I, I got want. the and I got the spicy chicken. Fuck me up with the Nando's. And because I had been throwing up so much the night before, I want. ate the spicy chicken Ooh. and it destroyed me. Right. Like it destroyed me. And I had to go on stage. So how old were you Ooh. during that? I was like 22, 23. Wow, youngin. Youngin. Now I'm 31. Oh. And I'm here to tell y'all about the stories of my travesties. Dang, 31. He just said it. Yep. I just said it. Now I'm 31. Yo, look, I'm not finna fuck around with you. I'm about fucking the 31. 31 thing. And like, it's the 31 all, thing. It's the 31 thing. And all the artists out there that's like popping, I don't give a fuck what you got going on. Like, if you got the number one song, if you got the number two, number three, anything top 10, yo, I can tell you some really real ass advice. If you want to ask, but if not, oh. fuck it. Learn like oh, I did. Hey! Wow. Just, uh, yeah, figure that one out. I'm sorry. It was like a complete sentence I was going to say anyway. I mean, but figure you know, it out you on might, your I own. I think they might want to know. I don't want, listen, I don't want y'all niggas to figure out on your own because I've been through it too. Well, I'm a nigga, up. listen, I'm a nigga from Decatur, Georgia. Fucking Decatur. I'm a nigga from Decatur that was fucking smoking a pack of black and miles a day. Zone six, Decatur family skate. Zone six, Black Decatur. I was, Decatur. I was at Decatur family skate. With the blue skate. Fucking look if you book. Like, I was fucking that <laughs> nigga. Like, are y'all not listening to me? Who? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> them, them, them. 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 Listen, I came up and fucking had not just number one, but I had the number one and the number two song. Period. On the fucking billboard charts. I got the plaque in my storage unit. We can bring I can it out go get it and bring it out time. and show you. We don't have it. Fucking today. Bruno Mars and Halo Williams. Number one and number two. At the same time. Do y'all understand that doesn't happen? So much so that my record label executives were like, look, we can make a lot of shit happen. This shit doesn't fucking happen every day. Nigga, you're fucking living the dream. Period. And I'm a nigga from Decatur who smoked black and mouths. Every all day. Of, all of, every one day. I smoke a pack I'm a day. I'm so weird about that. Like, I don't get that. I don't get why you and, wanna do that. <laughs> Were you smoking weed yet? No. I mean, yes, I was. Oh, I was, I was, I was like, well, that's I was, exactly why. <laughs> that's exact, but I'm saying, okay. the black and miles was not combined. You know how, like, you drink, smoke hookah, then right. hit the board? The black and miles were not that. No, the black like and miles. Like smoking, like the black and miles were their own thing. It was like okay. That was its own thing. I wake up in the morning like, and I'm, I'm gonna smoke a black, black and miles. And there's not like a little bit of blow in a black and mild. Like no, I feel like there's it's no gotta blow. be something. I didn't even know that, that you could do that. It didn't make you go like. I didn't know about no lean. I didn't know about no promethazine. I didn't know about no codeine. Just straight up, from Nothing, the store. Just black, just straight up black and mild wood too. That's what I straight want. I'll take a whole pack for the day. And so you take a nigga like that, and and then. You you have two num cool. a number one and number two song right. and you're fucking traveling the world. Yeah, next thing you fucking know, fucking crazy. Mm -hmm. You're in Madrid. And so all I'm saying is, <laughs> you're in Madrid. You're in Madrid. 
ordering. You're in Kuala Lumpur. Nando's. Nando's. You're in Madrid ordering Nando's. You're in the Nando's. You're in Kuala Lumpur. You're in Johannesburg. You're in Singapore. So what's the difference between the foreign bitches in the U.S. bitches? Like, what are the main things that y'all have experienced between... Foreign bitches the here, legs it's open, legs closed. Are U.S. bitches more bougie? Are the foreign bitches like American women? Good? They know how to hold their liquor a little better. I'll what say is, this. What's the differences? Like, I'll say this. What are we up against? None, yeah. none American. What are we up against? Yeah. Yo, that's <laughs> real. That's so real that she oh, put it like yes. that. They ain't coming over here, trust me. They ain't coming. <laughs> Hell no. She's right. Uh, all of the baddies in Australia and Africa and Europe and Kuala Lumpur and they're not in Canada. They're not coming. They're not coming they're not here. Coming. We don't have any desire. They're not coming here. Leave us. This at? ain't 90 Day no. Fiance. This ain't 90 Day Fiance. <laughs> Leave us where uh, we are. Yeah. But when you do go to Canada or United Kingdom or South Africa or West Africa or East Africa or Malaysia, or Indonesia, or Singapore, or Tokyo, or Japan, or Hong Kong, <laughs> or Russia. They fucking love American men. Mm, that's what's oh, yeah. to know. Okay. They fucking love American. Yo, just be American. Yeah. Just be yourself. Just fucking go. Be yourself. Just fucking go. <laughs> and all of the places you just named. Do they have to be a celebrity or no? You don't have to be a celebrity. And they gonna still be fucking with you. Yo, you can just yeah, go. American. They love Americans. And they be like, fuck me, American man. Except for the UK, though. So American they gonna fall boy. all over you. Not in the UK. Not in the UK. Nah. That's like, no, what? They hate Americans over there. I mean, listen, okay, yeah, uh, they hate Americans the same way women hate men, but they still have babies by men. Like, Do we hate men? Do you really hate men? Do women hate men? Well. Niggas hate. Or do women hate dicks? Yo, that's a good, like, okay, I think it's either or. You hate men and love dick. Or you love dick and hate men. Did, did oh. I just say the same thing? Yeah. yeah. yeah that's <laughs> you hate men or love dick, or you love dick and hate men? <laughs> it's the same thing. <laughs> or switch it. One okay. Of them. Like, you, yeah, and that's what I'm saying. Like, like in my experience, I guess as a rap, as a rap entrepreneur, a rap guy, right, that has traveled the world, right, with my soulmate. So, mm. so soulmate twin flame. What are y'all soulmate twin flame? We're just, we're just, we're just, we're just, twin twin, we're just twins. We're just twins. Twin we're twins. Twin flame. We're just twins. Y'all is soul planes. She is soul planes. <laughs> soul planes. <laughs> we're just, we're just twins. Y'all is soul planes. <laughs> soul planes. <laughs> y'all is Brad. Y'all are soul planes. Yes. That's what y'all are. Exactly. I've never, and you got on a purple hat. Exactly. Why is the purple hat so plain? Because y'all are so plain. Uh, <laughs> y'all are color. so plain. We're just twins. Y'all are twin flames? Why is she in? <laughs> Why are they flames? Why are they flames? Y'all don't know what twin flames are? No, I do. Uh, I, I know. I've been, I've, been been to, flames. I've been to all the sites, the Crystal Link sites. <laughs> all the sites. <laughs> uh, I've been to all the sites. Yeah, you know, that's, what, that's the vibe I'm getting. People feel like they can't intercept twin flames and I think that y'all need to shed light on like how receptive y'all are even though y'all might be soul planes <laughs> <laughs> that was a you know? uh, question I got a question I got a question for the females I mean I guess by the looks of it it's just y'all two it's just oh, us yeah. these don't uh, you left hey, you just us why them. Why? Are y'all prepared? I think I'm ready. Okay. What is it about penis that gets you emotional? It could stop. It could. <laughs> what is it? it what? It, it could, could stop? <laughs> it could stop. It can stop. Yes, it could stop. There's gonna be, let's just be honest. 
<laughs> when you get some good honest. dick, the, emo <laughs> the emotional part. Look, I'm getting emotional. Mm, that's terrible. I'm getting emotional. The emotion is it could stop. There's going to be a point, because you know you're crazy. There's gonna be a point when it's gonna stop. That's the fucking pro that's the fucking problem. It's gonna be there's gonna be a point hmm. and it's gonna stop. It's not gonna be there no more. You're not gonna have that dick the way you used to. It's just gonna be gone. Sounds... You already know that <laughs> if you're a certain size. Mm. <laughs> Gemini's. So Y'all already know. Gemini's, Taurus. I don't know, like, what if, okay, what if you've been fucking, know. what if you've been fucking the same person for, like, 15 years? People, <laughs> people, people fucking know who they are, they know. They that's, know. That's the thing. People be acting, they be acting like, yep, nope, you know who you are. And you this know, is why, <laughs> and crazy. this, this is why, if you go back to our original episode oh, of the podcast, I asked this question, Boom. and I'm going to ask it again. If it's a hit it and quit it, should it be discussed beforehand to prevent all insanity pleas and it's cases from happening? No. It's not gonna, the discussion doesn't it shouldn't, it doesn't anything. have to be discussed beforehand. We all discuss things we're gonna do that Everybody, don't happen. <laughs> niggas like vagina, bitches yeah. like dick, bitches like vagina. Do women like, like, do women like dick more than dudes mm -hmm. like vagina? No. Are we running over? Are we running over on our time? Because I'm starting to hiccup, and I don't want our listeners to feel like they're gonna feel like we're all drinking. They're gonna grab their drinks. They're gonna be like, you know what? They're gonna be like, you know what? We're all gonna drink. We're all gonna drink. We're all drinking. Everybody's drunk. Everything's crazy. Everything's crazy. Yep. Yo, Cam. Yo, Cam. I'm not gonna lie. I love you. I love you. Shout out to Cam. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like I feel like you're a bad influence on me. I know. To be honest, that's why I got left you're in 2019. I got left but. in 2019. <laughs> about that. People left me in 2019 because I'm not a good influence. But why do I like it though? I'm well, like, yes. I think that people have purposes in life. Tiff, your sister is here to to neck to badly influence me. Wow. That's why she's here. Stop. Shouts out to. Shouts out. I think you did this already. The universe. I did. <laughs> Shouts out to the mother of these two. I'm here to help people discover themselves. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> discover yourself. Yo, she's here to help you discover yourself. And then she... <laughs> She's here, she's here to help you. Uh, she's here to help you deal with yourself. Deal with yourself. She's here to help you deal with yourself. Delete yourself. Delete yourself. Get out of here. She's here to delete yourself. Mm. Don't. It, look. If you're trying to like feel good, no. Don't no, be coming over here. No. no don't come no, over here. No, not that, that side. Come to my side. Mm -hmm. So. Love uh, and support. Love 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 our producers are telling us we have to wrap this podcast up. We love don't. you guys, though. Don't. Uh, is there anything we want to say? Anybody want to shout out? Like, what the fuck? What the fuck's going on? Um, you know, it's Atlanta. Is this Bankhead Bounce? Are you cold? cold? You cold? Yo, she's so cold. She's Bankhead Bouncing. <laughs> she's Bankhead Bouncing. She's so warmer, warmer weather. She's a real '90s baby. Mm -hmm. Um, let me see if I want to say something before we go. Let you see. How was wine and dance? Wine and dance. Yeah. You do great. wine and dance every Friday. Dance. What's every up with the wine and dance? Twerk, twerk your life away, and I always have complimentary drinks, liquor, mm. Hennessy, whatever the fuck y'all turn up with. Liquor. I got it. I know. Because that's, Yo, that's what they want. They want the Hennessy. So yeah, Yo, if you Cam, like to dance, come fuck it up with me. Yo, Cam, Cam finds a whole different type of girls I never knew existed in Atlanta. I'd be yeah, like, girls. they've been here this whole time. I know. You never know. <laughs> Bring them out. Turn up. Turn like, up with me. What are you are you holding out on us? And if you're still weird, check me out on IG. Wine and dance mm -hmm. with Cam. That's how oh, we'll you find. That's how you Look find it. Out. We'll Look it, it up there. and come to the class. And you don't even gotta dance. Just come drink just and watch. see if you like it. See. <laughs> bring your nigga, bring your bitch. <laughs> bring your nigga, but bring I might your bitch. Take your bitch. I don't know. Oh God. It could be anything. Oh God. Yo, the niggas watch me like, hey, bring my bitch. Bring my bitch. I be taking off. She ain't going nowhere tonight. Right. She ain't going nowhere tonight. All right, y'all. We gonna. 
Uh, we're out of here. You know where to find us. Yes. You've seen our handles. You also, me. you've seen our P.O. box. This is the P.O. box. Yes. Tiff Don't wears eight and a half, nine in shoes. Mm -hmm. Medium. Mm -hmm. In pants, small Send and tops. Send my some shit. Period. Medium top, small top. Tops, What's your sizes? I wear six, women six. And my daughter. <laughs> Let's get real. <laughs> and, I, and I don't prefer clothes once again since this last week. <laughs> she did. <laughs> she well, did uh, I wear a large. Right. <laughs> large top, large bottom, 12 shoe. Uh, what's what? this? Medium hat? Hat? Mm. Hat? They medium. Look, look, look. Send me some. <laughs> yo, yo, I'm just wear. saying, like, don't send crystals. me no shit I can't wear, man. Like, yeah. come on. Like, yeah. I'm out of here. Yo, shouts out to Motion Minds. Fucking Motion Minds. And who motion got Minds the, who got the red it. tops? Like, shout out. Like, so Crushing it. Yeah, like, I didn't even know this was a thing. Like, look at this. Tiff's got that wagon on her. I'm gone, y'all. Let's go. Okay, we got. Let me go.